Hey there friends, I'm Nicole. I've lost 130 pounds and kept it off for seven years. And in this video, I'm gonna share my apple pie French toast casserole breakfast meal prep for easy weight loss. It's gonna be super tasty and about 27 grams of protein per serving. So this is what you need. First, you need two medium Granny Smith apples that have been washed and dried, and we're going to make the apple pie part first. So, you basically are going to peel and very thinly slice the apples. You're going to heat a pot on medium heat and melt half a tablespoon of light margarine. This is the one that I use, the light base cell. Once it's melted, you're going to add your apples and a heaping tablespoon of sweetener and a heaping quarter teaspoon of ground cinnamon and you're basically just gonna mink it around mix it around until they're well coated and then about three to five minutes until they're softened then while you're doing that preheat your oven to 350 degrees and spray an eight by eight dish with cooking spray. Now, while the oven's preheating, we're gonna make our French toast casserole part. So I'm gonna get a large bowl, and this is what you need. A tablespoon of vanilla extract, eight slices of whole wheat bread. I'm going to be making four days worth of the French toast, the apple pie French toast casserole, and I'm gonna serve it with Greek yogurt, which I'll show you after. So we've got eight slices of bread, equivalent to two per day, one cup of egg whites, two tablespoons of sweetener, two teaspoons of cinnamon, a third cup of almond milk, and I'm using the, or non-dairy milk, I'm using the silk unsweetened almond, and four large eggs. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to rip up the bread and set it aside. You can cube it if you like. I like to rip it because I just find it's quicker this way. Meal prep was super important for me on my weight loss journey because anytime I didn't have my meals prepped, especially breakfast, I would end up being super hungry, have no meals prepped, and then I would end up overeating and going way off track. So having tasty meals like this prepped and ready to go really helps set my day up for success and keep me on track during my journey, especially ones that are like super high protein like this that'll keep me full. So now our bread is done. Now I'm going to just pour all my ingredients in the bowl. The vanilla, egg whites, cinnamon and the sweetener, the milk, and then Sassy's favorite part is when I crack eggs. Love it. <laughs> Ding! Uh, that shelled it. <laughs> now I'm gonna whisk this all together until it's really well combined, and then I'm gonna add the bread. It smells like apple pie already with those sauteed apple slices and the cinnamon. Mm. Oh, and I can't wait to show them what we're gonna top it with, and then um, make make like a cool vanilla Greek yogurt to go on top. Okay, I got it all whisked up. Now I'm just gonna add my bread and. I like to use my hands to coat this up. I've made many different versions of the French toast casserole before. I've never made the apple pie one. I just, I had a craving for apple pie, so I thought, well, why not make a French toast casserole apple pie sort of deal? So there, we just wanna really well coat this, and then we're going to pour it in the prepared bacon dish. Make sure you get all your eggs and stuff and then press it in here and then I'm gonna put sprinkle my apples all over the top mm -hmm. oh it's looking sweet Seth <laughs> it's looking sweet as pie beautiful I'm gonna push a few babies in there there we go push a few apples Make it cute, make it cute. It's all about the cute, guys, all about the cute. Okay, 
Now it's ready to go in the oven and I'm gonna bake it at 350 and I'm thinking about 20 to 30 minutes, but I'll let you know exactly how much time once it is done. While that's baking, we're gonna make the Greek yogurt that I'm gonna put on top each morning when I eat it. So first I'll show you, I've got these meal prep containers. Like I said, it's gonna make four meals worth, but I'm gonna do a taster tonight, me and Sassy. So we've got one plate here for him and I to try it, and then three days worth of breakfast for me. And you can double or triple this recipe if you wanna make more meals and then just put them in the freezer. So what I'm gonna serve on the side is Greek yogurt, and I did get all these meal prep containers from Walmart, because I know you guys often ask. I have three containers. I'm gonna measure a quarter cup of this. It's the plain, uh, plain 0% Greek yogurt from Kirkland. What's from apple Costco. pie without vanilla topping, right? Ice so cream usually, but. This is, is kind of my thought behind this, is that this is gonna be like the ice cream, because what we're gonna do is make kind of like a vanilla ice cream style dollop to go on top. So this is a quarter cup of 0% plain fat-free Greek yogurt. It's gonna go in each container. Then we're gonna mix in some fat-free, sugar-free vanilla pudding mix. And I feel like that's gonna give it the ice creamy sort of thing that we're going for here. And I'm gonna make one for you and I for our taster, so. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and <laughs> now I'm gonna take a heaper, I like to call heaping things heapers. So we're gonna do a heaper quarter teaspoon of the vanilla pudding in each of these and then we're gonna mix it up and let's give it a mix a rooney here is anyone skin crawling from her scraping her mug with the oh, spoon oh that's gonna look <gasps> beautiful i can feel that so we're here. just gonna mix all these up and then i'm gonna put lids on these ones and put them in the fridge because these meals will keep good in the fridge three days and if you do end up making more, all I do is I freeze them in these containers and thaw them out the night before. I'm gonna eat them and microwave them for about a minute. And if I'm making more, I'll make the yogurt, you know, three days at a time. You know when it's mixed in, when it gets nice and thick and fluffy like that? That's what I really love with the pudding mix is it really is beautiful for so many things. It really looks like a buttercream. Uh, this is like kind of what I'm hoping. This is like my ice cream replacement. The friends, if you want to know exactly what it ate to lose the weight, I have lots of weight loss guides down below especially my new plan, leaner, not meaner. Brand new body fat, I mean, fat loss and body recomposition plan. And check out those links and you can get huddled if you want. HTLT subs, use code Nicole to save 10%. This is the new protein, the fruit cereal case and whey. It's so good. It tastes like the green fruit loops. And look at all the other cool stuff. You got pre-workout, you got Patriot Popsicle pre-pump. You got 100,000 plaque. Whoa, hi cutie. And look at these. Guys, these are great. Microwave it, 10 to 11 seconds. Tastiest treat you'll know. All right, the friends, it was 25 minutes just came out of the oven. 25 minutes at 350. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna dust it with some Basically, it's sugar-free icing sugar. There, This is the Truvia Sweet Complete icing sugar. I also use the Swerve sugar-free icing sugar, but I ran out. So basically, you can do this right now or you can do it the morning of, about a teaspoon you know, for your meal. But I'm doing this for thumbnail action, so we're gonna test this out and see. See if this looks cute. <laughs> <laughs> this is a process. This is the greatest day of my life. <laughs> Should we do a little more? I would just sprinkle it in your fingers and crush it, but 
I'm old school. Uh, I was trying to be like um fancy girl, but it didn't really work. <laughs> We're so, not fancy people. No, but I wanted to be cute in the thumbnail, but it didn't work. <laughs> okay, so the moral of the story, don't get fancy, just sprinkle the stuff. And um, now we're gonna cut it into four because we're making four meals. Just um, eyeball it as evenly as you can. And let's... Do the test. Will it lift out? All right. Mm -hmm. All right, here it is. The truth. The truth of the story. Did it work? Or did it work? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. I think one of these little pieces missed, but I'll add that after. Wow, look at how cute it is. Wow. Now, shall we do a little more dusting and, and make it cute? Yeah, you oh. got another secret too for the topping, right? I got a lot of secrets here. Okay, so because it didn't get the full teaspoon, I am gonna dust it a little bit more. And then, this is my other secret. So in the morning, I'm going to dust it with my icing sugar, sugar-free icing sugar, and then I'm going to drizzle on about a teaspoon and a half of this Smucker's No Sugar Added Sunday Syrup Caramel Flavor. Now, I have the teaspoon and a half here to measure, but for thumbnail action, I'm gonna drizzle it on so that it looks cute. We know about cuteness here, don't we? Oh yeah, oh, drizzle yeah. it up, baby. Whoa, that what? looks great. Now shall we maybe put the dollop of yoga on top? Let's do it. Okay. You got a trick up your sleeve for that too. Yes, let me show you. Not too much dancing there. We, it's not PG for YouTube. Sorry guys, look at this. Those were the yolks. And then my sassy had a cute idea about piping it on uh, in a bag. Do you think sass that it'll work or should we just bink it? Pipe it, you think? Uh, uh, we're not fancy. Let's, we're not. Let's ding it. Let's just dollop it. Oh. <gasps> oh. Nice. Oh. Whoa. What? Okay, we're going to get some more thumbnail action. Okay. All right. Thumbnail action is complete. We will taste it, but first I'm going to divide the rest of these into their containers. And like I said, good in the fridge for three days. I'm gonna heat them in the microwave the next day. Um, I'm gonna save for about a minute, but go for your preference. And then of course, top it with all my stuff. The Greek yogurt is ready to go in the fridge. Oh wow, I'm so excited to try this. I can't wait to try it too. I wanted it when it was finished to look like a piece of apple pie and I think that that's exactly what it looks like. So like if you were at Thanksgiving dinner and someone said this is for dessert, everyone would be jumping and yelling. This is why like creating tasty things is, was so important for me because I need to love my food in order to stick to it. And that's why I've been able to get the weight off and keep it off for so long. And Sassy, my husband, by the camera, he's lost the same amount of weight and kept it off for the same time because we eat stuff like this for breakfast. And so... Yeah, does this look like diet food? So let's, um, let's give the friends the calories for the meal and then we will do a taste test. So for this whole meal, that is the French toast, apple pie, French toast casserole with the caramel drizzle and the icing sugar and the Greek yogurt, you're, you have 423 calories, eight grams of fat, 68 grams of carbs, and 27 grams of protein. Wow. Not only is it gonna be tasty, but it's gonna keep me full. And I've got three tasty days of food here. So let's get some of everything, including one of these cute apples here. <laughs> Get a bigger bite. Mm -hmm. I still eat it off the counter. It's mm. fine. Oh my god! Whoa! Good. Wow! Can you do this? Can you eat a bite and film? Uh, I don't know. No. It'd be pretty tricky. It'd be pretty tricky. Oh my gosh, Sass, 
you're gonna know that you married me for something. <laughs> oh my gosh. I won't, I haven't known for 16 years until this day. Oh my gosh. Guys, you gotta get off the phone and make this now. What if they're on the computer? I meant like the old telephones, but I was making a joke. Why would they be on the telephone? Um, because I wanted to make a joke, but it didn't work. <laughs> you know like when people say get off the phone and do this now? No. No, I'm gonna edit all that last <laughs> minute right out of there. Basically, just go prep this for your week and you're gonna be happy. Yeah. All right, the friends, if you want more fun tips and beautiful food for loving your food, and this is what I do, love life, love Whoa. food. Dance around, be cute, love it. Don't forget to subscribe and check out more vids for that, cutie. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Catch you in the next one. Peace, my cutes. See ya. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it.